Before we begin this video, please click on subscribe, ring that notification bell, and like, comment, and share. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Ahit Dragon. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Google TV. The thing that many people have been requesting me since uh, yesterday, I guess, <laughs> or many days ago. But yesterday was the most recent request. So Google TV, Google TV, for those who don't know, it is an application which lets you watch movies and stuff. I think TV shows as well using your TV. No need to uh, plug your, uh, I mean, no need to, to insert a, a computer. I mean, to use your computer or console or, or anything else, as long as you have the internet connection. And Google TV can be summarized uh, in this uh, video right here made by Google, which is titled Welcome to Google TV, watched by 1 million people. So this is Google TV. Let me show you. As you can see here, there are stuff that you can watch, movies, and yeah, I guess some TV shows as well. You can use your voice to search instead of typing like that and stuff. Yeah, and I guess there is Game of Thrones. Wow, I didn't know that. Wow, look at that. You can watch stu those stuff. <laughs> Wow, it's so advanced. Hulu, Netflix, YouTube, whatever, all in Google TV. Yeah, uh, the last bit was, wasn't necessary. Anyway, so I'm going to show you how you can install Google TV step by step. First, make sure you go to your settings by pressing this button over here. That looks like a gear or something. And then go to settings over there. Go to network and internet and make sure that you connect to one of your available networks. Otherwise, there is another way. If you've got a LAN cable, let me show you how you can connect it to your TV. Let's say you got a LAN cable that looks like this. Well, this is what you gotta do. All right, make sure that it's set up uh, correctly. And then you insert it into the LAN cable port. Then it will automatically connect to your LAN cable for fast internet connection. After that, you grab your remote again and then you press the home button over here. Do you see it? Let me focus so you can see this one. All right, you press it and then go go right till you choose. Uh, then you're till you're selecting the Google Play. I mean, then you yeah, you're there. You get what I mean. All right, and then you press OK or whatever is in the middle. All right, then you go to search. You go. How do you do that? You go. Uh, let me show you. You go. You press up, the left, then down. Then you either you choose this option, which is the uh, voice search, or you go press right and then you type one by one so if you want to type this is how it's gonna be uh, let me show you yeah you, you just you just suffer go girl oh there it is google space t v or instead of doing that you can search with your voice this, the microphone is in your remote, so you press it and, and then you bring it to 
uh, closer to your mouth, to your mouth, and then you say it like this: Google TV. Yeah, there it is. Uh, not this one. Not this one. Go left. There you go. That's Google TV. It's look. Uh, there's some bracket that says previously known as Google Play Movies and TV. It has been renamed to Google TV. So I have it, but there is an update. If you don't have it, install it and then update it. Then you will wait pending. It's rated for 12 years old or over that, not under that. If it's under that, I guess it, you gotta have uh, some, I mean like it, that child must be guided by parents or guardians. All right, so after that, after you install it, you open it, and there you go. Well, th there's one more thing that you gotta uh, know. Depending on where you live and stuff, and which TV you have, you might not have the same UI. For example, the UI that I have might look different than the one that I've shown you in the trailer over there. But as you can see, it has the movies that I would like to watch. Spider-Man Far From Home, The Matrix, The Amazing Spider-Man 2, Spider-Man, the original one, Spider-Man 1, The Amazing Spider-Man, and so on. Look, you even got Harry Potter, Ready Player One, Spider-Man 2, Spider-Man 3. Do you ask for all that? I mean, what more can you ask for? Look, when you choose a movie, you can either watch the trailer, buy it, or rent it. The, uh, yeah, rent, renting is definitely the best option, I guess. Unless you want to re-watch re or replay the whole thing, then you can buy it. So yeah, what do we got here? First, you're gonna have new movies section which has the latest movies released for in this year, I guess. And then you have the top selling movies, then the recommendation depending on what you've watched and stuff or your rating, then the rental movies, I, I guess you can't buy them. I'm not sure what it means, rental movies. Yeah, I guess it's like the movies which is recommended uh, which are recommended to be rented, I guess. Okay, then we have the Fantasy Adventures Batman. Uh, I think it's unlimited. Is it? Nope. Yeah, family and stuff. You, you even got family movies. That's good. That's great for children. Then we've got the settings. We can turn on captions or also known as subtitles choose their default language and their size their color you can customize it let's see what what options we got oh that's a lot of options <laughs> you can do that yourself i'm just gonna leave it white on black default i think yeah display of course you can choose to play the next episode automatically or not Depending on your usage. Yeah, then we got the different genres. Basically what we just saw before that. Yeah. And the watch list. <laughs> I don't have any watch list yet. But, yeah, I, you can also search. Let's see. Let's try to search a movie. Well, I'm gonna search a movie which I don't expect to be here. Hmm. Naruto. Well, well, look what we got here. Hold on. Let me try something else. The last Naruto of the movie. Nope. Not all movies are here. So, yeah. You gotta... You gotta see which movies there are. But there are some de decent ones. Yeah, so I guess... Yeah, and then after you installed Google TV, so if you go home, you will find it right here. 
So if you come back from somewhere, you go right. This is Google TV, also known as Google Play Movies and TV. I really would like to show you guys, I mean like, just give you a preview of how it will look like. Look like. I mean, if I could watch a movie right now, I'm sure I would get copyrighted. But there is, there is nothing stopping me from watching the trailer. So, here goes nothing. This is like a preview of, of how the movies will be. Oh, the quality. I think I'm sure the quality of the movies will be better than the trailer right here. Look. <laughs> I'm sure you don't notice it, but it's really blurry in real life. Oh, okay, it's getting better. Wow, so this is how the movies would look like. Now it's in an HD. Look, this is just a preview. Alright, listen up. Therefore, I have value. No, 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 that's not what I meant. And that's gonna be. I think she really likes me. That's really nice. Really want to be home. So nice to finally meet you, Spider Man. Hear me, Fury. Put some clothes on. Let's go for a ride. Think Nick Fury just hacked her summer vacation. Awesome! You got gifts, Parker. But you have a job to do. Are you going to step up or not? Hmm. So nice, isn't it? Friends are in trouble? Well, if you haven't watched the movie, you should definitely watch it. I highly recommend it. And coming soon is the the last movie of uh, Homecoming or whatever Spider-Man. I mean of Tom Holland Spider-Man, I guess you could say. Which is called Spider-Man No Way Home. Who is that guy? He's like Iron Man and Thor rolled into one. He's not Spider-Man. What is it with you and Spider-Man? Well, he looks out for the neighborhood, has a dope suit, and I really <laughs> respect him. Loser. Well, well, well. Well, so that's how you install Google TV. If you have any questions, leave your thoughts down in the comments below. Make sure you uh, click over here and here to subscribe and like and stuff. And yeah, I hope that I finally have done the uh, like I have completed your request and all this clear if you have any doubts and stuff uh, yeah just as I said before you leave it in the comments and I'll see you uh, yeah before that watch this video and I'll see you next time so yeah as a reminder subscribe and ring the bell and all that good stuff about liking and commenting and sharing and goodbye see you next time